What's up guys, it's your super players back at it again and it's your host Tony G bringing you another awesome Market Watch on Market Monday. So if you're new to the channel and you love these type of videos and Market Watches, definitely hit that like button, subscribe, and definitely comment down below if there's any cards that are worth mentioning. And in this video we're going to be talking about some of the cards that got banned, some of the cards that got errated, and some of the cards that are getting bought out, maybe because of the ban list impacting this set. So let's go into it. Um, now that we've seen some cards get banned, I'm going to be talking them about them and limiting. I want to talk about this card specifically is SS3 Gohan Master Surpassed. I think this is a very good game finisher as we know that now that Fu Shroud and Mystery is gone, we need to figure out what's another best way to have a finisher for a deck. And I think this guy is very phenomenal. Um, sitting at relatively very cheap. I think now that the sets are going to be going on a little longer, you definitely want to catch or get some of these game finishing cards for some of the card, uh, some certain decks, of course. So definitely talking about this guy is very awesome, especially with Pan Ser com combination of both. It's a very good buy, I would say. Pick it up, guys. It's very worth the money. So it's sitting at 397, and moving to the card fest, you might want to get one or two if you're playing blue or I mean blue, <laughs> green or red, and. Very cool card to have. It looks awesome too. So going on to the next card is one that's being bought out and it's skyrocketed. It was sitting at $90 and it went up $50 to $60 now over a week span. And so I am tripping out on that. Like nobody was picking up these cards. Maybe someone figured out how to break the meta and or break any deck <laughs> with this card. And so it's the Wicked Saiyans, one of the SCRs from the Saiyan Showdown set. And it was sitting at $91 at one point, and now it went up to $148, and it's relatively expensive. You're looking at $150 or $160 being the cheapest, and now $184 is the most expensive. People have bought them out. There's only a few listings. There's only one page, so definitely, definitely, if you have, if you got one relatively cheap, you just saved yourself a lot of money. And then going on to the next card is going to be the Radiant Saiyans. Another card that was not actually going up in price, it plummeted. <laughs> and so the Radiant Saiyans, another card from the Saiyan Showdown set, or SCR, was sitting at 95 and now it's sitting at $73. It went down $20. I mean, that's huge in my opinion for an SCR, especially that it was 90 bucks a few weeks ago and now it's at 73 that's pretty insane in my opinion so if you're trying to get it it's a really good time to buy this one if you're trying to save some money because who knows red blue might make a comeback and we've been hearing or seeing a red blue soul striker deck so this might work relatively great in that deck just because you might need um an alternative for an ser if you don't have hatchiac this card's pretty awesome in my opinion and then we go on to the power of the Super Saiyan, a card that got limited to one. You could see how much it plummeted in the last few weeks. It went from being one of the most sought out uh, SPRs from this set, which was Supreme Rivalry. And now it's actually so many listings because obviously Bandai limited this card to one now to every deck. And obviously we want to talk about the SR variant as well. So you see a huge decrease as well at $8. Actually. You're better off getting the SPR in my opinion, just because the S the SR is just about a dollar twenty less. Get the SPR. <laughs> You're, yeah, it might be ten bucks, but eight forty for an SR. I mean, what's an extra dollar and sixty or eighty cents on top of that? I mean, you get an SPR. Who doesn't want an SPR? And then we go on to the cards that got banned. Of course, Fru Shattered and Mystery. Shoutouts to David, <laughs> our team member, David Fuji. One of his favorite cards, one of his favorite characters in the game, just got hit with the bad hammer. Very good card. Very good game finisher. People were saying this guy was SCR status. Only They should have been only playing this guy at 1 because people are only playing it at 1. And he's a really good game finisher. And obviously, Fushrod and Mystery is at $12.99. It definitely saw a decrease, but not a significant decrease, but a decrease at most of $3. <laughs> And then we go on to the SR variant. This one saw a bigger decrease. It went from being a 99 cents, or it was actually $2. Now it's at 99 cents. So half off, guys. <laughs> Get yourself an SR one <laughs> for only a dollar. But like I said, another card that got banned. 
And then we go on to the next card, Son Goku Calamity Challenger, a card that is being bought out. This card, I've been saying this card is bananas, guys. No one's ever believed me. I've been playing blue for such a long time, and people are like, why are you playing this card? I'm like, no, it's a very good card. If everyone, like, doesn't know, this guy, you play one blue energy. If your lead card is blue Saiyan card, and you have three or more energy, play this card from your hand and draw one card. And he's a deflect blocker so no matter what you could either defend or attack so it's a very defensive and offensive card in my opinion and then with the combination of what is it called i think there's a goku that bounces it back and you could just do this whole cycle you could draw two cards for like one or two energy it's insane and you get a 20 20 uh beat stick on board so 13.99 people are realizing how good of a card it is i've been knowing i bought them when they were like two dollars and nobody was buying them and it's $19.99. <laughs> so if you have it, you save money. If you didn't, now you're going to be spending some money. <laughs> and then we go on to the next card. is Realm of the uh, Gods Booster Pack. I just want to touch base until this set drops. So you guys could see this decrease. Did I impact the prices from last week? Maybe. Because I was saying everyone is insane to put them at such a high price. But it's slowly going down, guys. As, of course, we're getting closer to the set dropping. So... The hype is real. This set's going to be awesome. They haven't announced the God Rare yet. So stay tuned if you aren't following uh, Dragon Ball Super Cardium on Facebook. You definitely should because they will be announcing the God Rare very, very soon. And then obviously we want to talk, talk about the overview of all these awesome cards. So here they are. They're slowly going down in price, obviously, as we get closer to the set release. And because people are realizing people watch market watches and they're insane to put it at $1,000 or something. <laughs> And there you guys have it from your host, Tony G. Hope you guys like this Market Monday. Definitely comment down below for next week's uh, Market Watch if there's any cards you want me to mention for the next awesome Market Monday. And there you guys have it from your host, Tony G. Like always, y'all stay super.